sure you're wondering what this box is. Well, it's another mystery box. It's been a while since I opened one. I think the last one was the Loot Crate box and the BAM box, but today we have some snacks called Bussin' Snacks. Well, let's open it and see if these are really bussin'. I opened this up and I thought it would be like the other mystery boxes where there's like another box inside. There's even a picture on the website that shows you some bussin' snacks box, but as you can see, it's just packing peanuts at a Pokemon car for some reason. It says, enjoy your snacks, bringing you exotic snacks and drinks from around the world to your doorstep. Yep, the logo shows it. All right, let's see what we got here. Like I said earlier, we got a, a Pokemon card for some reason. Nice, nice increased. All right, let's get it open and see what's inside. Do, do you guys like packing peanuts? These things are like the worst. Oh, that looks nice. We got some Pikachu and Piplup snacks. It's like chocolate. It's gotta be chocolate, right? Like these little cookies. So at the end, I'm gonna just show everything. I just wanna dig in here for now. Got the Naruto ramen, of course, with the Kakashi. Little, just Kakashi on there, that looks nice. Kind of smells like ramen just now. All right. Oh, look at that. They love P um, Pikachu and Piplup. But Eevee is nice. Gengar. It's pretty cool. A little, it's like gummy candies in there. Nah, this is actually cool. All right. All right. Damn, I feel like I reached the bottom already. Okay, we got the bubble wrap soda. Got Pichu. 78 calories, in case you guys care. <laughs> this is cool. A lot of Pokemon themed. I guess once they mean around the world, it's just Japan and Pokemon. Thought it was going to be like some German snacks in here or something. All right, we got some Pikachu wafers. It's like chocolate and vanilla. And you see, this is like what I hate about these packing peanuts. They like cling to everything. Of course, that's going to be everywhere now. Okay, so we got one more thing. I was about to say that this, this can't be it. This is a Ramune. It's better not because we could get this here. And it is. I, I wonder if I've seen this one before. It's grape flavored. It's from Boruto. I'm not sure if I've seen this one before. I actually hate grape, but. We'll try it out and see. This box kind of smells like, I don't know, somebody's like old house. It has that same smell like when you buy stuff from eBay and it's like video games that's been stored in an attic for a while. Let's get that out of here. Damn, there's still more packing peanuts. So here you have it. This is all we got, including the old Pokemon card. This is all from Bussin Snacks, like I said before, but I don't know. Is, it, is this even a lot of stuff? This is like two, four, five, six things. I almost forgot the Ramune. Six things we got here. And I, I had to pop the price on the screen. I think this was like $30 I paid for this just because I had a discount. I'm pretty sure because everything's Pokemon themed and Naruto and Boruto themed that they try to give you a little upcharge. But a lot of these things you could find almost in your local grocery store if they have. So I'm definitely not gonna be able to eat this ramen right now. So I'll put that to the side. Let's get more of these snacks. Got the Pikachu Lime Drink. At the top it says Q-Doll. Anybody familiar with this brand? Three, All right, let's two, open it up. One, go! Now this just in, police uh, officers in Lancaster, Pennsylvania were asking people to be on the lookout for a man who robbed a store. And I think, yeah, I think we do, we do have his description. Can we take that? Let's take his description. We're going to straighten you out. This will fix you. That was buzzing. It got everywhere just for it to taste pretty much disgusting. It's just sparkling water. It says lime flavored and it, it has pretty much no taste. Put that to the side because that, that got everywhere. And it had one of these like 
can tops that open up and come fully off. But everything's like all drenched now. Let's move on to the, the wafer. On it, it says five Oreo chocolate bar, milk chocolate flavor. Okay, so these are Oreo. Oh yeah, I see the blue now. That, that would make sense. So we get five of those in the box. How small they are. Here's a look on the inside. And mm, not bad. Doesn't taste like anything special. It tastes more like a s'mores than an Oreo. I guess because of the milk chocolate. These these are busting. I think I think these are busting. Put those to the side. Let's wash it down with some. It it didn't get any better. Let's see. We just had chocolate, so let's just do one more chocolate. Not not much else here. What do these say? No English on these ones, but I'm just gonna assume they're fully rich chocolate chip cookies with chocolate chips inside. I think there's also like a little special prize or something it says in there. These are all individually packaged. Get them all out. They're pretty cute. All right, so who we have? I'm, I'm gonna say Pan Champ, Plusle and Mining, of course. We got another Mining, and Score Bunny. Almost forgot that one. They feel so small. They have like a, a volcano kind of shape where the bottom, not the bottom, the top has like a, a dip in it. Ooh, here we go. Look at the detail on that cookie. And pretty rich, like I said. Let's open up the gummy bears. And each of them has like a different flavor on it. It's like soda. I've had candy like this before from Japan where it's like soda hard candy though. But these are gummies, which is cool change. So we got the blue one. I'm assuming is that ramune normal flavor. We got lime. Got the Eevee, which of course is probably like a cola. And we have grape. Hey, here you go. go. Go ahead and grab one. All right, now that you got one, let me get one. Who I got? A Pikachu? It looked like Pikachu, but it was flavored like Gengar. The ears weren't as far apart. Hmm. All right, that's my last sip of that disgusting mess. Let's get onto the Ramune that everybody knows about by now. But they don't like grape that much. Let me know in the comments. Do you guys like grape or what's your favorite flavor of Ramune? Eh, yeah, I don't like grape that much, but it doesn't have that normal grape flavor that tastes like cough medicine. It's a, a subtle grape flavor. Nothing too crazy. It's just not that sweet. And last we got the Naruto ramen. This one says Naruto ramen and, and that's it. It just says Naruto ramen with all the ingredients and everything on there. Let's pop it open. I'm not going to eat this now because honestly I just ate, but just to see it more, what it looks like. Yeah, and this looks like a standard instant ramen. Nothing special about it. Oh, what the hell? Let's just open it. Ooh, we got a collapsible fork. Right in the middle where that groove is, that's where I just snapped it together. Nothing special, just, just regular ramen. Well, we're left with a whole bunch of mess from these bussin' snacks, but you be the judge. Let me know which one was your favorite, and do you think this was worth it? Eh, I don't know. I think the packaging is really what's selling it, so I'd rather just eat the packaging. Peace.